All right, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. As we lighted the first candle of Advent last week, we were reminded of the great promise the prophets made of the coming Messiah, the Lord Jesus. Just as they told us, he indeed was born of a virgin in the city of Bethlehem. During the second week of this Advent season, we look not only toward that great promise being fulfilled, but we also recognize the praise and glory Jesus deserves. The scripture we'll be reading is Luke 2, 8 through 15. And there were in the same country shepherds abiding in the field, keeping watch over their flock by night. And lo, the angel of the Lord came upon them, and the glory of the Lord shone round about them, and they were sore afraid. And the angel said unto them, Fear not, for behold, I bring you good tidings of great joy, which shall be to all people. For unto you is born this day in the city of David a Savior, which is Christ the Lord. And that shall be a sign unto you, you shall find the babe wrapped in swaddling clothes, lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a multitude of heavenly hosts praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace, good will toward men. And it came to pass, as the angels were gone away from them into heaven, the shepherds said one to another, Let us now go even unto Bethlehem, and see this thing which has come to pass, which the Lord hath made known unto us. Let's pray. Thank you, Lord, for this day, Lord. We just thank you, Lord, that we have your word, Lord. And we thank you, Lord, that you have come for us, Lord, uh, in your birth, Lord. And in your life, you live for us, Lord, as a servant, Lord. And we thank you, Lord, that you died, Lord, that we can be saved, Lord. And we thank you, Lord, for all these promises in your word, Lord, that were fulfilled, Lord. That we, Lord, can look towards your promise, Lord, that you've given us, that you're coming again, Lord. And we thank you, Lord, for what you've done here, Lord, in our lives, Lord. And we thank you, Lord, that you've given us a place, Lord, that we can serve you, Lord, and that we can lift you up, Lord. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. 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 